New York has changed its voter registration to allow 16 and 17 year olds to pre-register. A person who is at least 16 years of age and who is otherwise qualified to register to vote may pre-register to vote and shall automatically be registered upon reaching the age of eligibility. Harvey Weinstein has been diagnosed with coronavirus while in prison. Many prisons are now fighting for early parole for some invites, inmates to avoid the spread of the disease throughout prisons. Early this morning, China announced that they will be lifting the lockdown placed on Wuhan to ground zero for the coronavirus pandemic on April 8th. For other cities in the Hubei province, lockdown measures will be ended on Wednesday following a significant reduction in the number of new infections, with the number of new cases being one since March 19th, and that one being confirmed this morning. Overall, the province has been the source of a majority of the number of new cases and fatalities in China, with almost 68,000 people infected and 3,160 deaths. A cruise ship with over 42 passengers claimed to have flu-like symptoms. The people who are sick on the Florida cruise are 13 passengers and 29 crew members that were on board the Holland American Xanum. It is undetermined if they have the COVID-19 virus or it's the common flu. The guests were asked to stay in their staterooms and the ship was to dock on March 30th. All of the crew members who were affected and passengers were put in quarantine until further instructions. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Seniors working on the Senior Variety Show, let's take advantage of the delay and keep working on finishing up those scripts so that when we get back, uh, the show will be ready to go. The art department just received word from Scholastic Art Awards that Mallory Kramer received a national silver key. And while school is closed, uh, school counselors will be reaching out to you via email, so please check your student email accounts regularly. Sophomores, if you have not had your sophomore meeting with your counselor yet, please check your email for a message from your counselor about scheduling a video chat or phone call to pick your classes for next year. AP exams will continue, although they will be shortened to 45 minutes, and students will have to take the exams at home. More information will be provided as we move closer to testing dates. Please stand for the pledge. Forty-one and a low of 34. There will be snow showers in the morning, and it will continue to heat up after that. Wednesday will have a high of 47 and a low of 34, and there will be more clouds than sun. Thursday will have a high of 54 and a low of 35, and there will be chances of rain showers in the afternoon. Um, and then Friday, again, we'll have a high of 46 and a low of 36. Morning clouds will be followed with the afternoon sun. I'm Andrew with you with you. virus has basically canceled all sports. Some corporations like NASCAR have seemed to get around it. The NASCAR Corporation recently introduced